Hello viewers. Welcome to today's video. In this video, we will be exploring the bonus panel under the cashback plugin in detail. If you have purchased the cashback plugin, you will also have the option of providing bonus to your users. There are two types of bonuses which you can see here. First one is automated bonus like joining bonus and referral bonus. This will be credited to the user's account automatically. For details on automating this, refer to our video on site-wide cashback settings. Link will be in the description box below. Apart from automated bonuses, you can also manually assign bonus to your user as a marketing plan on Black Friday, Cyber Monday, or on any other festive day. So, let's get started. First of all, go to your WordPress admin panel. Then go to cashback and click on bonuses. It will take you to this page. Here, you can view the list of users who have received a bonus. You can also edit entries if you wish to. You can do that by using the options available here. Let's see how we can add a single new entry. Just click on new. A new entry window will pop up on your screen like this. First up, choose the user who is to receive the bonus. Next up we have to fill up the bonus details. First field is name. Here you need to fill in the type of bonus that you want to give to your user. For example, joining bonus, referral bonus, new year bonus etc. For now, let's go with Black Friday bonus. Now, enter the amount of bonus you wish to give. Say for example, $25. Next up we have the date. Here we need to enter the date and time of the bonus. Please note this default format of date and time. Here, you can select the status of the bonus. Whether it is approved, rejected or pending for verification. For now, let's select approved. Lastly, we have comments. You can choose to enter any comment here for the user. Alternatively, you can also choose to leave this blank. Once you have entered all the details, click on Create. As you can see, a new entry has been created here. Let's check it out in the User Panel as well. Go to the User Panel and click on Bonuses. As you can see, the entry is updated here too. Instead of adding single entries, you can also add bulk entries. It is very simple. Let me show you. First of all, click on Export to CSV. This will download a CSV file to your computer. You need to upload the data in this format. You can add or even edit the records using this file. If you add a new ID, then a new entry will be created. And if you wish to update an existing entry, just make sure to keep this ID number unchanged. After updating the data, just save this file. Now go to your WordPress admin panel and click on Choose File button here. Then select the file that you just saved and click Upload. All the changes you made will be reflected here. We have covered the bulk upload of records in detail in a different video. Link will be in the description box below. Now, with that out of the way, let's see how we can edit entries here. Select a row by clicking on it. Then, click on Edit. It will open a pop-up window on your screen like this. Now make the changes that you wish to. Let's change the status to Pending for verification. Then click on Update. As you can see, the entry is now updated here. It will also be updated in the User Panel. Let's check that out too. Go to the User Panel and refresh the page. As you can see, the status is updated here. But what if you wish to edit multiple entries at a time? Don't worry. You can do that too. Just click on a row. Then press the Shift key and click on the last row of the series that you want to update. This way, you will have a sequential selection. You can also select random rows. Just click on a row. Then hold the control key and select the rows you want to edit. This way, you will have a selection of random rows. Once you have selected the rows, click on edit. 
You can change the comment for all the entries from here. Let's say bonus approved. Then click on update. As you can see, comment has been updated for all the selected rows. Let's check it out in the user panel as well. Go to the user panel and refresh the page. As you can see, the comments have been updated here too. Lastly, let's see how you can delete entries. It is just as easy if not easier. Just select a record that you want to delete and click on delete from here. The entry has been deleted as you can see. As simple as that. Let's check this in the user panel too. Just go to the user panel and refresh the page. As you can see that entry has been deleted. That's all for this video. For more such tutorials, please subscribe to our channel. Thank you.